Well, turning now to the war in Israel. And as the military, Israeli military continues the ground invasion into Gaza, they claim to have killed a top Hamas commander during a strike on a refugee camp. All right, Linda Schmidt joins us live in studio with the latest. Linda. Yeah, well, Stephen Natasha, the Israeli military saying that that Hamas commander was one of the leaders of that terror attack in Israel on October 7th. They say that he was hiding out among Palestinian civilians and using them as human shields. <laughs> Palestinians rush to hospitals after Israeli airstrikes bombard a refugee camp outside Gaza City. Israel saying the airstrike killed a top Hamas commander who helped lead the October 7th slaughter of more than 1,400 people in Israel. Officials say the Hamas commander was hiding in the Palestinian refugee camp using innocent people as shields. It comes as Israeli forces push deeper into the Gaza Strip. The military saying it is targeting Hamas rocket launch positions and tunnels, where ammunition and potentially many hostages are held. In coordinated land and air attacks, they killed terrorists and continue to attack hundreds of targets of the murderous Hamas organization. Search teams working to rescue people from another refugee camp. An Israeli airstrike reducing many of the buildings to rubble. No word yet on the number of people killed. Israeli forces are also seeing clashes escalate with Hezbollah on the Lebanon border. Hezbollah, which is backed by Iran, pledging to ramp up fighting if Israel began a ground invasion of the Gaza Strip. And the humanitarian disaster in Gaza is growing. Food, water, and medical supplies are not arriving fast enough. So we know there's an awful lot that needs to, that needs to happen to, to, keep, to accelerate and to increase that flow of aid. And also for you tonight, the Defense Department saying that the U.S. is sending 300 more troops to the U.S. Central Command region, which covers the Middle East. They are going to be providing communication and other support. Stephen Natasha, back over well. to you. All right, thanks, Linda.